Why should I choose silver and not gold? 95% of the gold that's ever been mined is still in existence in some form of another because it has been treasured. And yet 95%, if not more, of the silver that has ever been mined has been destroyed or used in such small quantities. For all practical purposes, it's gone forever. The elite and their central banks own tons of gold and no silver. Silver is cheaper than gold. The average American can buy one ounce of silver without much thought. But if he wants to even buy one ounce of gold, he would probably have to talk to his spouse about it. This means that when the chickens come home to roost, people will be able to afford silver on the way up than they will be able to afford gold. Gold has very few uses compared to silver. Gold mines are common, but silver is mined mainly as a byproduct of other minerals and metals like zinc. The Gold Antitrust Action Committee has led the charge for years in exposing bankers' manipulation of gold. Their investigations and awareness campaigns have, have led to a heightened awareness of gold in the investment community. GATA is headed by Chris Powell and Bill Murphy. This group spent $265,000 to get a full-page article in the Wall Street Journal asking, where is our gold? This brave action asked the investment community why our gold reserves have not been audited in 50 years and how much gold we really have. I judge men not by the answers they give, but by the questions they ask. This question was a direct assault in the heart of the beast. Gotta found out that awareness campaigns are nice, but they do not change the game. And I remember a year or so after that, Gotta actually came out and supported the idea to actually sell gold and buy silver. Because the battle against the bankers is easier to win in the silver market. No central banks have silver to sell like they do gold. The market for silver is so small compared to gold that very little money would be needed to have the bankers capitulate in their duplicitous acts. When the Gold Antitrust Action Committee says to sell gold and buy silver, you have to pay attention. Silver has been used as an industrial metal for the past hundred years and has not been cherished for what it really is, a precious metal. Industrial metals like aluminum, copper, and iron are plentiful and can be used in huge quantities and disposed of or recycled. Unlike most industrial metals, silver is used in such small quantities in proportion to the finished product that it's not recycled except in photography. So My socks have nano silver on them too and they kill the bacteria that, that ew. Silver literally has been thrown away into toxic trash piles all over the world and thus has disappeared. In fact, here's a chart showing for the past 64 years the world has consumed more silver than it's produced. 